Uh, my name's John Holway. I've been in Spain on the Costa del Sol for 20 years now. I work for a company called Viva, where we are. It's called Viva Homes Under the Sun. And it is the largest multi-branch real estate uh, company on the coast. We have 12 offices, soon to open two more, one in Estepona and another in Nerja. So we cover the whole, pretty much the whole coast now, about 130 kilometers. We've had incredible highs and some pretty sad lows. But actually since November 2011, the, the market for us has picked up and it, it's been consistent since then. We had a very good start to 2014 and 2015 is now looking like an exciting year. If people ask, when is the time to buy? Now is the time to buy, really. 2014 saw a lot of people coming into the market who had been looking for a long time. We, we've always felt that um, the public haven't not wanted to buy in Spain, but lots of pressures have stopped them buying in Spain. But there's still the same amount of people's dreams of having a second home is still there. So we're just waiting for that dam to break and for everybody to come. Just to give you an idea, uh, what we did in 2014, we went to two exhibitions uh, in the UK. It was the first time we'd been to an exhibition for six years in the UK. They were the A Place in the Sun exhibitions. One was in London and the other was, was in Birmingham. Uh, we had product we, we sold actually at the exhibition, which was very exciting for us and we had no idea whether that was going to work and it did and that was a very good hint of what the market was doing. It's given us enough confidence that we're looking at doing our own exhibitions in the future. In the old days Viva 98% were probably UK and Irish. Now it's 30%. The rest divided Scandinavians, French, all nationalities really. Because people know what they want now, the people coming into the market know exactly what they're looking for. If it's a bargain, they're snapping it up. Inland at the moment, it seems to be doing very well. Why? Because you're getting a lot of property for your money. A lot of the, the problems with buying inland has now been resolved. Are the banks helping the industry? Uh, some are and some aren't. Generally now, the banks realise they have to divest themselves and a couple of the banks have done, have been very proactive and have shifted a lot of properties. There are some that are still hanging on for dear life. There is very little new build. There are some people that come into the market now. Um, a great example, one of our partner, partners is Taylor Wimpy. They took the risk and they built off plan, they sold off plan very successfully. All their developments are doing very well. But they study the market and they looked at what people wanted and they built accordingly and they've sold. We would love to have some off plan. Uh, it's gradually coming into the market. The interesting thing is 2014 saw a lot of land transactions uh, up significantly from 2013, which can only mean that those people are starting to think about construction. And construction is starting, but we are looking all the time for new new build properties because the market is there. People like something new. Prognosis for 2015. I think we're already excited. I mean, Viva's excited, been excited for the last two and a half years, really. Um, it's what we do, it's, we're excited about it. 2015, it's very difficult to predict. 2014 was certainly a much better than the year than 2013. And we're looking at 2015 to be a better year than 2014. Um, Prices will stabilise, there's no doubt about that. We're already seeing that, especially in the, in the markets such as Marbella. The bargains are not all shot. We saw in 2014, very specific people were coming and getting great bargains. Are there going to be as many? No, there aren't. That's definitely, they're sort of getting more few and far between. But we still doesn't mean to say we don't have fantastic properties because we do have great products and there are there are new products or new old products that are coming onto market at bargain prices and prices may still may go up. You know, the likes of the developers we were talking about, Taylor Wimpy, have actually increased their prices in second phases. So that's a good sign. So I think 2015, whether it's going to the kickoff year, I couldn't predict that, but I think it's going to be a better year uh, than 2014.